Hey guys, how are you? Welcome back to our channel, Chandra Awesome again. Um, uh, today's, in this today's topic, guys, we will. I am going to teach you how to design an earphone using surfaces in on shape CAD software. As I am just only teaching you how to work with the tool, but I am not teaching you how to design right so today i'm going to just going to teach you how to make this uh earphones just by using surfaces actually these are my earphone models both wired earphones and just created when i bought so i'm going to show you how this is you can do just by using surface and it is very easy guys let's jump into the tutorial I'm going to give my idea past studio. So, as for example, I'm going to take this wide headphone shape. You can see how it is visible shape. Okay. These are this model is show me wide headphones, not the port. So I just take an example, you can create another one. So for making you understand, okay. So we need to create this. We need to create this shape. You can clearly see how this the shape is looking. Okay. So let's jump into the tutorial and draw some design. It's like some cool, right? Let's jump into it and draw one. Going to set the front plane, set the sketch. I'm going to draw the sketch again. Yeah. See how does it work looking, guys? Just like am I doing right or not? I will join now. Uh, so from the space we created and we need to add a curve right here, right? Okay. So sell the arc. Create some more and move some things like this. Sell line again and draw some like this this is that's it guys and we need to add and we need to add some arc to the upper surface so let's try a complete line here because the cap is different and this one is different okay so i'm going to select conic arc I want curve at this point. Then, then this much enough. Just give dimension to this arc. Two point seven. Just much enough. Now let's give dimensions. This is two point four. Point one three. I'm just giving the near values, guys. You can take and go by this without totally your wish. And when is the point nine? I think that's enough. Just we need to add access to each and tap. So, to okay, the sketch now we need to perform revolve operation here because you can see you can already see our revolve first here. Okay, so to perform revolve operation and by using surface, not a solid. Just click on the edges which you want to revolve operation. We don't need this actually because it's a hell of shape. Okay. Select the roll axis and let's see. We just now created the pillow part. Just how it's showing right here. And we need to draw in this upper part. Let's do that also. Uh, 
Let's do the sketch. Cell for our operation again. Cell the curve. Cell the axis. And yeah. See? Just now we just completed this one. Now, what is the we know to add extra one? This this earbud shape it is not actually straight guys you can clearly see uh, you can observe you can understand it is not exactly perpendicular to the shape it was somewhat bent so for that we need to do the cement to that it should not at the center it should be at the corner of uh, one corner of this uh, head so for now just edit the sketch even you can add the sketch but i don't want to create many sketches because it's not a good one but for me it's i love it i like like this okay just set rectangle And draw uh, some height and give dimension to this rectangle dimension to be the point zero five is enough and the size should be let's keep point three and give that distance as many as much possible guys. We need to maintain some distance because it should not be interacted, even though it's not private, but it's best for us. Let's give dimension here. Okay, that's enough. I think we completed now. We need to do that over operation again to this. See, just now we created the hole. Now we need. We need this two hole to be uh, but angle, but it's somewhat very small, guys. Let's we edit it. The normal distance should be 0.1. I think that's is that too much now. I think that's enough. I think that's enough for guys. Okay, uh, and give some distance to 0.4. Okay, that's good. Now, what we need to do is uh, we need to add this earbud. So, for that, also very simple, guys. Just edit the sketch here, and we need an arc here. Now, select the three point arc, just select the point, and give some base and make this shape. And now, do dimension to each. should be point three and given I'm hit my head guys she make this distance how much it should be to find uh, uh it's a point two I think that's enough for me now i'm going to get this one i want to add this to so the input shape will also be found here see just now the input shape can be visible but it should be somewhat long right because oh, it's too much short it's moving we forgot to give dimension here from center it should be 0 0.45 0 0.4 is the amount it should be too near 0.45 yeah that's enough and and okay the sketch 
but the uh, earbud distance is somewhat not satisfied right because if you can see it should have some shape but here not like that for that we need to add the sketch just stretches the earth okay Mm. Need to increase, but we need now it's looking good. So like this, you have to edit, guys, and just just like done here. So don't mind about that. But you can also perform. Uh, you can give the uh, shapes as per you want. It puts okay. Now just what we need is. Uh, we need to rotate this one how to meet it is by using transform tool you can perform that so to perform that we need one thing uh, first of all let's increase the side to point eight this too much point something Okay, think that's enough for me. Now we need to bend like this, guys. So for that we need to have some, some axis. For that axis, I'm just going to offset point plane here and making at this point. Uh, and I'm going to draw some line at the point we just created because. I want an axis to rotate the parts, so that's why I created here. And I'm going to use the transform tool, select the entity, use rotate, and axis should be what was the line I have run just before. See, now it is bending. I want to bend right here, and it should be 20 degrees is enough. I think that's enough, right? Yeah. Now we will add guys, but uh, this is too small, if it's too small, and add some distance here, point, point, two. I think that's, that's enough, you can also give some shapes guys, I'm just performing right here, now just hide the sketches, we don't need any of them, now we need to add this surface to this surface how you can do that to perform that the the on chip is updated with a new tool called face blend so we can use this face blend tool right here i need to add this surface you can also perform balloon operation but you can see the inside surface is not going to be attached to it so for that only we need to use face blend so just we need to sell this one not do sell this one and we need to select this here see but it's called but you cannot get the shares by just using the like this see now the fillet operation added and also the face is blended to each other you can also just apply manipulating with the directions you can perform this this is just for example how to perform work with face blend guys but it is having several tools i will explain it in the other tutorial so this is how we can create the air font shape just by using surface design you can also change color if you want of the face you need to add the part right yeah. just like you can see we just really created you can also add the legs to sharp edges uh, 0.02 is just too much 0.02 
kali dengan itu nah Dan smooth edges like 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 this. Okay. Now we completely tan and see. We just created this two parts here, two surfaces that I will do. One is upper part, and the other one is base part. This is just surface design, guys. I hope you might understand how to design this. Did I cause too much complicated? Means uh, please let me know in the comment box. I will explain you again if possible. Okay. Uh, that's all about today's topic, guys. I hope you might understand. Understand the uh, understand my tutorial how to design this. Uh, uh, I think we almost got the shape yeah, like this. So if you really like our content, please do like and share and subscribe our channel, guys. Uh, if you will subscribe, it will be more wait for my more to wait for me, and it will also for give you more tutorials and designs in the Archive Cast software for free. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Have a nice day.